Oh. oh hesitation. I saw that moment. <laughs> I hesitated. Yeah, no. You gotta believe. You gotta just. You gotta just jump it. I have faith. I definitely. Uh, have that's what. <laughs> I, I like the fact that because Mario Maker includes uh, the four different game styles, it really sort of brings out. Uh, you have to use all okay, the now that he's got it, once he can figure it out now, or do it again. Just well, go for it, just full throttle, no hesitation, oh, he's feeling oh. it. Oh. I'm gonna pass it on over to Sis for one here. Alright, I'll give it, a, give it a try again. You guys are brutal. <laughs> that's, what they, that's what they're known for. Would you say that this that is a brutal Mario? Nope! <laughs> <laughs> Here, let me go ahead and make guys, that section. Yeah, let me just show you guys. This is what happened to us when we were working. You know, we were we were working on the courses for the final. A lot of times you have somebody play something, and you realize it's too difficult, and you don't want it to bog down. So, you know, maybe this section is a little too hard. Maybe I need to just fill this in with note blocks. <laughs> nah. Why not? Oh no! Oh, you know? oh! I mean, I'll throw a few a few bloopers in, but uh, oh, that's gonna be hard. Right? And you know, why not have a fire flower okay. come out of that pipe? And this part was giving you a little trouble too, so maybe I'll just give you a uh, lock it to cloud. Uh, no, don't. You're already making it easier. Uh, don't make. So, so, <laughs> you just shook him right out of the cloud. Did you, when Super Metroid came up on screen, did you know that you had it at that moment? Did you did you feel like you could? You, know, you were the only one oh, to pull that off. There's a fire flower in that pipe. You didn't wait. Or, and you can just tap the minus button or just tap play, and you can start to play it in pieces. All right, very nice. Very nice. I, I thought I had it, and then I realized that the the buttons were the, the default controls, which I don't use. So then I was like, wait, I might not have it. <laughs> but eventually I adjusted, and, and I got a pretty good lead and made it through. Did you think about saving the animals? That's my question. Yeah, there Say it again. Did you think about saving when the you're animals on the way out? Your cloud. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just see them. Oh, All right, no. we're down to the sub-level. Let's see if you remember how to link this thing oh. together. There it is. Oh! Oh! oh, does he oh, oh, what, oh, oh my God! Which one is? <laughs> <laughs> oh. What is that? Oh! Oh! <laughs> choose wisely. Choose. <laughs> did he choose wisely? Yes, he did. Ah! Oh, 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 just oh. barely. All right. We've all done it. <laughs> oh, no. oh. Morgan, that was cruel, man. I know. I think I, that may have been a, a bug in the course here. Let me actually go ahead and All right. let me go ahead and pull this out one. Let me back in. Oh, it's oh okay. And let me give you another shot at that. Oops. You know, regardless of how terrible I'm doing, I'm still having the last play. <laughs> But it's really hard. It's, it's honestly, it's difficult to make something the first time that is a, a perfect playthrough. There we go. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. Everything's fine. Oh. Everything's fine. There you go. It's okay. What? He throws ba bombs? He just left him in the dust. He went high road. Yeah. yeah it's the only smart thing. Yes. Hey, yeah. all right. Yeah. Nice work. Uh. <laughs> Very nice. Nice work. Yeah, that well, was fun. Guys. And I got, you know, it's, it's, it's hard again, like we talked about. It, it, you, you really can't make a course in what would it take, 10 minutes. Yeah. And, and it's not really, you make it, you, you work through it, you have somebody play it, you tweak it. Um, that's sort of what we're all really excited about with this software. And uh, yeah, I've seen, I've seen a lot of you guys that competed like here at the booth, trying the different games and stuff. So, Absolutely. Yeah, it's been a really well, fun, fun week. Well, thank you guys so much for hanging out with us. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> At least, uh, trying that was a funny game. level. Uh, thank you guys both. Uh, that is it for uh, Super Mario Maker today. We're going to be back with uh, one more game right yeah, when we get back. Oh, one on more. This might be the anywhere. final one. Now then, while I'm thinking of it, I'm going to finish up this match with, as Bowser against Falco, Game & Watch, and Duck Hunt. Oop. Whoa! He just tried to blow himself up. Yeah, Giga Bowser time! KO in out of that.
Oh, Game & Watch is out. So it's down to me, Falco, and Duck Hunt. Double fire! Bowser wins. As he should. Oh wow, I took those two out both at the exact same time. <laughs> nice. Sync up. Hopefully. Xenoblade Chronicles X in the background. <laughs> you know, I had a lot of fun with this one. I don't know if I'll be doing this again tomorrow. Actually, I don't think I will. As fun as this was, I want to uh, be able to do my own thing tomorrow. And, uh watch us freely. So, maybe next time, um, next E3 I'll just cover the non-treehouse stuff. Hopefully they'll have plenty of awesome stuff next E3. And I'll be able to get the videos out quicker. Hey everybody, welcome back to Nintendo Treehouse Live at E3. I'm Ed, I'm here with Demetrius, Ray, and a very special guest, uh, Mr. Hino from Level 5 is here with us today. And uh, we're going to talk a little bit about uh, the, the development and some of the thoughts that went into a couple games here that Level 5 has coming out, uh, LBX and Yokai Watch. Oh, okay. And uh, so before uh, we jump in, we're going to do LBX first. Yes. Yeah, so yes. let's go ahead and Demetrius is going to help us out with that. So if you might have seen this earlier today, actually, I have a, we played a little bit of LBX earlier. So this is what I have now is a little bit more of a played up file. And we're going to go ahead and talk about... Uh, some of the customization options at first since we have the opportunity of having Mr. Hino here. Uh, uh could you turn down that music a bit? The world of LBX, I can barely hear you. LBX 
子供たちにとってリアルなロボットも。That thing looks like a shogun. あの等身大のまあもう本当にこう、その手に取れるロボットにして、それを本当にプラモデルとして発売して、で、その本当にあるリアリズムみたいなものを作る、そういう新しいロボットのあの作品を作ろうと思いました。So, um, also, what I really was playing an Earthbound song there for a second. Is that,、um, <laughs> well, you know, when you look, think of robots, it's kind of surreal at times, but we really wanted to bring the realism into the、uh, people who play these games, make it feel like it's real. So instead of going for the huge giant sized robot, we look at, looked at a、uh, real sized robot that would、uh, fit on the palm of your hand. And、uh, we also made plastic models out of it and really tried to bring the realism into the、uh, game itself. And you can fit、awesome. to the palm of your hand literally. <laughs> so, speaking of like, the customization, I'm, I'm curious. <laughs> there's, there's so many different parts and options. And how, how was that in developing? Was there any, like, was it really tough?、Uh, maybe a little insight on that. まあ、カスタマイズの,あのいろんな種類があるんですけど、まあ、カスタマイズの種類がすごく多くて、少しあの開発に関して難しかったと思うんですけど、カスタマイズに関して少しお話しいただけますでしょうか。そうですね、まああのパーツの種類が4000種類あってやっぱその一つ一つのパーツにやっぱりあの個性がつけられているのでもうあのまあ自分好みのロ、まあ、LBX を作って、えー、遊べるというところがこのゲームの最大の魅力だと思ってましてその物語を進めながらその自分好みの、まあ、自分独自のその LBX を作ってその強い LBX と戦うっていうのがまああのこのゲームの面白さです。So um yeah as you can see there's actually about over four t h u s a n parts to c u s t o m i z e s there's a lot. That is a lot. <laughs> That <laughs> is more than a lot. <laughs> That's just excessive. So we really wanted to provide players with all of the options to really create their very own unique LBX. <laughs> And once you create that,、uh, you can challenge difficult foes, challenge your friends to be able to really feel that your creation has come to life and are battling with the other people. Wow, that's a lot of in depth customization <laughs> options. That's <laughs> yes, awesome.、Indeed. All right. So, Oops, what do you, walk us through what you're doing here, Demetrius. Yeah, so what, what, you got, what everyone's seeing here is I started out with an LBX that was a very heavy one. It's called the Deku.、Um, the Deku? The rating was really, really low. It was an E. So, what I went through is in、uh, creating kind of an、uh, alternate. So, I took. Oops. <laughs> Can we go back? So, I kept most of the Deku parts, but I took out the chest and put in a destroyer LBX chest piece、okay. and the legs. This already increased the speed by a lot. And then I can go in. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I press the Y button and I can reinforce normal and lighten. So this lowers the weight and makes the speed、okay. go up much, much, much faster. So it's、okay. definitely the way that you want to go. So that now I can go much faster. So each of these parts have, like I mentioned, a, a different characteristics. So it's not only the looks that you're customizing, but it's like, as you mentioned, the weight, the special moves that you can use, as well as the looks. So there's three, three main things that you can customize and make your own LBX. Yes, correct.、Awesome. And one of the reasons, too, I also changed my chest and my legs is because I wanted to make sure that not only am I moving faster, but I'm also increasing my defense against one of my most biggest weaknesses, which was Smash. So I、okay. balanced it out and made sure I wasn't able to get attacked. <laughs> Okay. Alright, let me make sure. Trust these. Okay. Why would you want to guard against Smash? That's a super awesome game. <laughs> Probably not the Smash I'm talking about, though. There's two really interesting elements story wise for me. Um, one is the notion that、uh, these battles are taking place in the sort of cardboard arena, and how that came about、uh, in terms、oh, of the story and why that came about in this world of LBX, why that was necessary. あのこの LBX のストーリーに関してなんですが、このバトルというのはすべてあのまあダンボール箱みたいなので起こるバトあのバトルなんですが、それについてあの少しお話しいただけます。どういった形でそのゲームの世界の中でダンボールが作られたのかというようなそうですね。あのまあ、この作品自体はあのジオラマというようなその戦闘の舞台を使ってやるというのを最初に発想したんですけどもまあストーリーがあのいわゆるこう
ただ子どもたちが戦うだけじゃなくて24のようにこう世界の危機が来て、えー、その世界,をの世界の危機を子どもたちが救うというところにもあるので最初はこの段ボールのジオラマの中だけで、えー、戦うんですけどもその先の物語になるとその段ボールの外の,あのリアルな世界の中で戦うというシーンも出てきます。So actually,、um, like you mentioned, a lot of the battles happen within this、uh, cardboard box. It's like a, almost like a diorama. But the story expands actually beyond that because、uh, soon, uh, soon we wanted to make, it, make the game sort of like、um, 24, where、um, every time there's like a, a world ending apocalyptic crisis, and these kids are supposed to solve that. And so it, the initial battles happen within the confines of the cardboard box. But as the story progresses, as the、uh, As what's at stake becomes larger and larger, it goes beyond that and goes out into the real world. Very cool. Oh no. Oh, Demetrius.、No. And he lost. Oh, we I, barely I got knew greedy, you, Demetrius. I got greedy. <laughs> I got too greedy. Vans, I, I need to toughen up, he says.、That's、All right, so、fair. tell what happened there. What happened there? What so, you, are you going to go back to the drawing、yeah. board on this?、Like、no, so what, what I did there was I, everything was going great, but I wasn't paying attention to my health bar. I should have actually healed <laughs>、okay. in that regard. So I'll go ahead and do it again. So we can just pin this squarely on you. <laughs> 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 I'm still learning this game. It's, it's, it's a, more than just customizing.、Okay. You have to make sure you're on point as well. All right, let's do this again. Now, one thing I, I wasn't able to overhear was、uh, can we discuss maybe the difference between creating the characters, like creating the bad guys and the good guys? Was there any challenges in that? I was going to ask you to ask me 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 to 子どもたちが悪と戦うっていうのにしたいと思ってるんですけどもやっぱりこうそのこの作品って世界を子どもたちが救わなきゃいけないっていう壮大なあの設定があるのでそのちょっと複雑な部分もあるんですけど物語上でもやっぱりそれをあの明確に一つ一つのバトルがこの戦いに勝つと一体何があの起きるのかこの戦いに勝つことで。何がこうあの得られるのかみたいなことを一つ一つの戦いに設定してあってあのこの戦いに勝ちたいと思う気持ちを煽るような作りになってます。Big decisions that are left to, to children to solve, like saving the world. The kids are supposed to do this. So, there's a lot of complex、uh, plot twists and motivations involved with this game. But what we really focused on was try to make sure that each, every single major battle has a very clear、uh, focus. What's at stake? What happens when you lose? What happens when you r e a d We really tried to make that very clear so that for the player, they know what they're getting into and they know what the, the impact that this battle has on not only the story of the game, but the world in the game. The consequences within the game itself. So, in the battle, what do you think about the battle? What do you think about the battle? What do you think about the battle? That's correct. That's correct. Cool. Excellent, cool. excellent. And what I'm just doing here, I just wanted to show the viewers at home that. That there is more than just one area. There is actually a, a giant map to this game. Oh, wow. You can go to multiple areas to kind of investigate different, different situations. Cool. You have city station, the mall, riverside shops. That is a、There's、massive that, amount of places to go. Sure, sure. Yeah, one of the things I really like about, about this game is that the, the battles themselves, the movement is really fluid. And it's just, it's just really fun to be able to go ahead, customize yourself, spec yourself out the way you want. Your weapons, your armor, your own style, and be able to go in. Because, I mean, there's melee attacks, there's different, different missile、yeah. attacks, there's all these different ways to, to battle, and it's just, it's a very, it's a very fluid、uh, interaction with, with the enemies. It's really nice. <laughs> Excellent.、Very、Do、cool. we want to move on to yours? Yeah, I think,、um, you know, let's、uh, go ahead and、uh, move into a little yokai. If, if that's yeah, cool. Yeah, so that's yokai. All right.、Awesome. Okay. So,、um, 
we'll switch on over here. So for um, the people who may or may not, uh, who may not have um, gotten our uh, saw our segment uh, yesterday on uh, yokai, I, I was wondering if uh, Mr. Hino could maybe just explain um, what uh, what yokai watch means, what a yokai is, for s as if someone were hearing it for the first time. ちょっと準備をしている間にあの日野さんにあの妖怪ウォッチとは何なのか妖怪とは何なのかについてを少しお話し